you're a grown man. He's a grown man. There's nothing I could do or say that'll calm him down. Just like there's nothing I could do or say that'll calm you down. He's an old, old, dementia fuck. He has a problem with dementia. He's an old fuck. He's an old fuck who's trying to trying to fuck around with me. I told him I'm not the one. I'm not the one. I don't give a fuck about about well, this shit. Here. You guys need to hash it out. You guys are in the same room. But you can't coexist when you're this mad. So you, he's in here now. You guys need to talk it out. And I told you, because you you, you told me I told you I told you and I told you if they, if I hash it out, it's going to get ugly. I warned no, you not to not, not to check me. Prince. What the fuck do you want, old man? What the fuck do you want? You made some inappropriate comments about women that I didn't care for. I didn't make and any appropriate you. comments. See, you're sitting there saying I made appropriate comments. I didn't do that. I didn't do that. You need to stop. You need to stop putting fucking words in my mouth. Because I didn't do that shit. I would never words, do that shit. But you need to stop putting words word, in my mouth. The words are in the chat, man. I didn't do that shit. I only privately spoke to you. This is why I don't DM. You guys shouldn't be DMing each other. Because this well, is how it always turns out. Everything yeah. needs to be public so that people can be held accountable. Now, if you guys want other people brought into it, it's impossible. You, we don't, we don't know what the hell happened behind there. closed doors. Hold on, Weasley. He wants to sit there and, and twist my words and say, I'm the, I did something very heinous to her. I didn't do anything to her. I don't even speak I to her. Why don't you just ask her? Why don't you just ask her? I, 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 I was I there for her. I was I actually there you. for her. When you, you want to twist my words. I didn't say you did anything uh, heinous. Yes, you did. Okay. Yes, you made a cut. No. Don't, don't try to twist my fucking words, old man. Don't try to twist my words, old man. Kenneth, can you call, can you calm Prince down? It's your buddy. Can you calm him down, Kenneth? Stop! What in the blue heavens is going on? Yo, oh, you're a little, little old. You little old butt buddy fuck is sitting there accusing me of something I didn't do. So, yeah, no, calm Prince cool. down. Prince is upset. There's a miscommunication, oh. and where it all started oh, is in DMs, so nobody's going to know really what was said, because everything should be public in here. That's one yeah, of the but, rules. I mean, yeah, but I mean, they can be printed very easily. And right, but guys shouldn't be in, in the each Kenny? DMs anyway. Kenny, you know what I'm saying? You, I'm going to say this. Kenny, if I were you, if you have any respect for me, you keep this man away from me. Otherwise, Lisa Joe Cannon is going to witness a murder. And it's going to be public. <laughs> Don't I'm say that, that Prince. I'm telling you, Prince. I'm that's telling ridiculous. You. I'm telling you. Prince, that's ridiculous. He's the and he's gonna find They're out. not going to murder it's, it's, anybody. Stop saying like that. Stop saying that. Now, you guys got an argument in, in messages. This is why guys shouldn't message each other. And I know that Pete's probably trying to save a girl over here. But no, this is how just, it turns out. This is always I, I, how it no, turns out. I just Peter. kept it very simple. I just kept no, it I know, but you're, you need to call people I, out in public so that this kind of stuff doesn't happen. Because this is what? always what happens. You this is why I don't do right. it. Weasley, you told me to call him out. You said call him out properly. That, that was no, your I, no. And I when I said, you, when you, said, let, 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 let me finish. I do. Prince, let me finish. When you messaged me about this, I said, you need to call him out publicly because I don't play in the DMs. That's not my playground, not in the DMs. I did exactly what you told me, though. I know. I I'm not like saying you. you shouldn't have. I'm saying that the DMs between you guys are the things that we don't know about. We don't know any of the facts because it's your word against his word. This is why we can't help. I can't help you guys because I don't know what the fuck was said. But I will say this. You can't just go around telling people you're going to kill them. That's actually against the law. So you have to be careful with that. Now, if Pete That's wanted to, if Pete wanted to, he could fucking... To call the cops and say, hey, this guy's threatening to kill me, and you might get in trouble. So you just have to be careful with that, Prince. You just said it's on the internet. He doesn't have any information on me. But I can find information on you, buddy. Oh, no, 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 let's not. That's not going to solve anything. Make <sighs> let's not threaten anything. Not Thank you, over threats. Especially over internet crap. Come on now. That's yeah. I'm going to say this. I'm going to say this tonight. Old man, when I'm on the paddle, you stay the fuck away from me. You hear me? You stay the fuck away from me. If I'm on the paddle, you get the fuck off. Because I know Kenny, and I have every right to say that. I met Kenny in real life. You haven't. Some of you haven't even met Kenny in real life. So I'm telling you right now, old man, you mess with me, you get off. I don't want to see you on the paddle when I'm on the paddle. Okay, End of the story. Point. End of the story. Point. You can block him. End of the him. story. He has every right to be up here as well. You can block him, though, if you don't want to hear what he has to say. Because I don't like when people put words in my mouth. I'm not that type of person. Okay, but again, the, I, didn't, I didn't put any words in your mouth. I merely disagreed with something you said, and I said, I don't want to hear it. That's it. And he wants to kill I, you over that? 
I said, he said something that I felt was inappropriate. I said, listen, I don't want to hear this. I, I Peter, felt it was save yourself. No, what you did, stop, stop, I know what I said. I know what I Peter. said. I know what I said, but you want to sit there and, and twist it and make this into a whole big shindig. I, I know what I, told what, you, dude, I, I already still, know. I even told you. I even told you on the phone call on this. I said, I was just messing with you. I was just messing with you. Because you do the same shit to people, too. You did the same shit to me. You was fucking around with me. I was fucking around with you, and look what happened. Look what happened. You're the one that took it too far. You're the one that made this happen. I don't disrespect people like that. Do Neither do I. Does anyone else in here know what happened? Well, I think here, let me, let me just try to see. I think I figured out what happened. Uh, Prince said something that Peter didn't like about a girl, and he was being Captain save ho and he fucking messaged Prince to say, hey, don't disrespect girls. You got to do that publicly or else this is what happens. People are not ever held accountable but I didn't when you guys her. are playing in the DMs. I didn't disrespect her. I didn't disrespect her. Right. I never we're trying to translate everything and we can't because everything was said in DM, which is like it should be the forbidden zone for things like this because now nobody knows what the fuck happened. How am I supposed to be on anybody's side around this when I don't know what was said? I warned you weekly. DM. I'm letting you know now. I'm letting everyone know that's coming in. I warned you. I don't even I DM anybody. Like, yeah. This is why. This is why well, you don't finish. DM people around here. Let me finish. I literally said to, to, to you, Weasley, hey, man, I have a problem. I, no, I really said I have a problem. Call me when you get some time. Right. And then I told you what the situation was. And I said, you call me out publicly. Don't do it. And, and I told that's you. What you. I responded. You I did. responded to you. It won't get ugly if I call him out. And look where we are right now. I told right. you. Right. I didn't expect you to say that you were going to kill him. That's just I crossing every line. What do you think was going to happen? I told you. I thought you were going to act like an adult. I, let it, I, let I thought you were going to act like a responsible adult and say, hey, Pete, we have a difference of opinion. Let's squash this beef like men. I didn't think you were going to say, I'm going to kill you, old man. Lisa Jordan is going to witness a murder. That's not what you say. In front of your That's family. Right. Oh, which, I told, which I told them, I said, listen, I don't, I don't want no part of it. I'm done with it. End of story. I forgot about it. And then all this happened. But Pete, you got, come on, dude. You're DMing dudes that trying to trying to save girls. This is not no, going to work. No, this is no, how it happens. He, no, he no, he was calling me over something else. And then he said he needs to talk to me. And then yeah, he, and you and you twist my whole entire word. That's that's what you did. You twist everything. Around. I called you. But, but, but they're your words. Around, they're your words, and, and you they're... twist everything around. You twisted everything around. Yeah, yeah I admit. I admit to that. I did call this guy. I did have a proper conversation with you. And then what do you do? You just twisted my entire words. And then let me get a word in. And then say, "Oh, I'm done. I'm busy." And then I started texting you. And then next, you know, I find out we are arguing. We're not arguing. I just said I wanted no part of it. I just said I wanted no part of it. This That's was all. this involving Kenneth? No, not at all. No. Wow, no. that shocks me. I mean, I just I didn't know what you two would have in common if it's not. It's him. about girls. Somebody said he disrespected a girl. I this didn't. Like, Honest to God, I didn't. I know, but like, this is my point. It's like, why are you guys talking behind the scenes about girls? Like, it's so stupid. Kind of creepy. Went, it went from A to Z. I know, but Pete, then, you're always listen. Yeah. I love you, Pete, but this is what you do. You're Captain Save a Ho, and it never works out. This but, is what happens. I mean, but I mean, if somebody met, you know, if somebody fucks with a girl, either call them out publicly or let the girl deal with it. But again, it, it wasn't my thing. I merely said I wanted no part of it. You know what? You know what? You know what? Tell them who it was. Tell us you tell everyone who it was that I disrespected. And I guarantee you, you tell her I did not disrespect her. Tell her because she's on the server. Don't make me don't make me add her in here and make her tell her story. Amora, I didn't Amora disrespect who it is. We we kind of know that. Yeah, I never disrespected her because I don't even know her. So this guy is putting words in my mouth, and then he's trying to call me out. But you're just mad because I beat you the punchline. I beat you the punchline because I wasn't going to let you try to sit here and say something about me. You know. You know. And another thing. Another thing. I'm getting sick and tired of you and Terry. I really am. I really am getting sick and tired of you guys. Always trying to paint a picture that I'm a bad guy. I am not a bad person. I don't think you guys are making me be a bad person. I've never bad done guy. that. I've never done that. And I'm the first one to, I'm the first one to, uh, to say that it's clear that you love Kenneth. I have oh, never Kenneth painted you as a bad person. Staying out of it. Oh, well. I have never, ever said you have anything less than the highest degree of love for Kenneth. And I want to say sorry to Kenneth, but Kenneth, you know how I get. And, and, and you know how I get. And you, like, you, like a hundred other people, might not put things in the, in the best way, but Good everybody's guilty of that. 
Everybody's that? guilty of that. I love it's that. a good I stream. You. That was a great stream, Shamrock. I said, oh, that yeah. I said, nobody could ever question your commitment to Kenneth. And people have heard me say that, including Telly, by the way. So don't tell me I try to paint you in a bad light. I think because of what the two of you have in common, I think you're important to him. And I've never said anything less. Ever. My and suggestion as for, is that and as, as, for Max, less... as for Max Legal, I don't know Max Legal. Lethal. Unless girls huh? ask for your help. Lethal. Don't I, try to I help everybody. Weezy, I wasn't trying to help. I just said, listen, I, I, this this makes me uncomfortable. I, I just don't want any part of it. Say that publicly, though. But, Pete. But nothing, it makes you seem like you're Pete, in the... In, Pete, nothing why, I, you see how it makes why you were y'all in DMs about it? Nothing, Gidget or Shamrock, whoever speaking, Weasley, nothing I said to this man. I, I called him first before I even texted him. Nothing I said on the phone call was disrespectful, was 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 nasty. I had a, uh, uh, I had some questions. Pete answered those questions. Next thing you know, he literally tells me, oh, I have to take care of business. So, okay, you're busy. And then he texts me some weird shit about Amora. I'm like, dude, what are you, what are you talking about? I was oh, asking no. questions. I said, what, I said what you said I was uncomfortable with. And, you know, I just didn't want any part yeah, of it. In what all. situation yeah, I, is it okay I, I, I for you to say I'm, I'm uncomfortable with this? Why are people it, 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 was, it was directed at me. Oh, it was direct oh that makes so much yeah, sense. That, I thought you that were just makes... that that's the big difference, Peter. I'm yeah. sorry. I thought you were saying somebody's talking shit about Imora. Right. Let me slide in the DMs. Exactly. Like, exactly. I, don't know, exactly. I don't know her well enough to do that, Wheezy. Okay, I good. Well I agree. That. That's why no, I was on yeah. you, Peter. That's why I was but like, dude, just leave it alone. It, it was directed at me, and I felt uncomfortable about it, and I didn't want any part of it. By but all no, means, I'm sorry. I misunderstood. It was a fucking question. All you had to do was say yeah, it was a question. But you were sitting there oh, uncomfortable. Why are you doing this? Why are you talking bad about it? I'm like, dude, I'm I get it, Pete. I'm sorry. I, I thought you were it's just okay. like trying to protect her, no. and you had nothing to do with it. I'm like, dude, I don't know her well enough. And, and as far as I know, she has some kind of... Uh, Re relationship with uh well, she's mad at me, I'm mad at her. I'm mad at her Cap because Cap her and Leaf aren't getting along. Captain Cuckold or Captain Cook. Yeah, yeah, young Cook. Yeah, so that that's their business. But when when someone approaches me and some and says that uh, you know somebody need well, never mind. I'm not going to repeat it. But uh, I I just don't really like to hear about people being spoken about that way. And I I just I wanted to end it. Period. Okay. I didn't think it was yeah. about you, Pete. So I was like, what the fuck are you fighting other people's battles yeah. for? I thought, I'm, yeah, I'm that's not. exactly what I thought was that, you know, he said something, you know, just randomly about her. And, but yeah, that's you know, what now I thought. That you explained it. No, no. That makes more sense. Sorry, Pete. I misunderstood that. And I was like, what the fuck? But Prince. It's okay. Prince. You can't be telling people you're going to kill him, buddy. Like, if it was Pete was somebody else, he might be liable to call the cops. But he kept, get... he kept agging it on. Instead of applying yeah, but... back to me or calling me back, you kept agging me on and agging me on and agging me on. Look what I got. Look what I got. Like what like I... said, trying to be Captain Saberhole. Oh. It, no, it had nothing to do with that. What I tried yes, to do it did. Say, yes, it did, old I, man. Yes, it did. At the end did. of the day, the you truth. saying you're going to kill truth. somebody, that trumps everything else I've heard up here right I now. Agree, Shamrock. I agree, Shamrock. He egged me on. That's he, he kept on egging There's me on. no excuse. No, That's no Even excuse. if you egg someone on, you don't threaten Over violence, internet let shit? alone death. Yeah, Over I internet agree with you're that. Gonna, you say you're going to kill him and you don't care if his family... That, and Come on. You say I'm going to block you, or I don't want to be... The funny part was, he's like, anymore. Elisa Jordan is going to witness a murder. And I have to say, I chuckled. But that's not <laughs> people good. Happy birthday, Elisa. <laughs> yeah. Happy birthday. I'm going to kill you. This is what I'm going to give you for your birthday. I'm going to kill somebody right in front of I'm you. A, I'm going to blow out your butt. Oh, never mind. <laughs> Weasley, Weasley, I told you it would get ugly. I, I, I warned you, man. I, you can't say I, I didn't warn you. No, you I did. Listen, you. he sent me a DM and he said, hey, I need to talk to you about some beef. And I said, let's bring the beef to the public square because we're not going to play beef. That. You never said that. No one, no one. What could happen? But what I'm saying is, it's not a place for DMs. I don't know what the Prince. fuck's going on. So Prince. why do I play in the DM sandbox? That's not my style. You bring it publicly. Do, do, would you like to tell them what you said? I'm not I gonna, would like I'm to not hear gonna, it. I'm yeah, not going to put it out there. Huh? Tell us. Come on. Do you want, oh. do you want, to, do you want to tell them? Let, but can you tell them what you said to me, the reason why I probably counteracted with that? 
I he said. Why are you guys keeping it secret? It's really yeah, weird. I, that's, that's weird. Pretty- no, 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 no. Okay, okay, okay. I'll, I'll tell them what I said. I said, oh, she's whining. She's complaining. She's, she needs to go find a man and get fucked and stuff like that. And he was saying, oh, don't fuck me. Don't fuck me, Prince. I was like, no, I'm not saying that. I'm not, I'm not implying that. And then he goes, oh, I'm uncomfortable now. I mean, I'm not uncomfortable that you would talk that way about it. I'm like, dude, what are you even talking about? I was just kidding around because you were kidding around. And then he goes, well, well, Prince, you're coming off disrespectful. You're coming off real harsh. You're coming off real, and you And you say you're a family man. You got a daughter, and you're a good friend of Kenneth. But you're not showing me that. You're showing me otherwise. You're showing me you're a bad person by talking about it more. I'm like, no one's talking about it. I, I didn't say he was a bad person. I said I, I held him in a certain high regard because of the way he defends Kenneth. And he's kind of, he's kind of uh, making her look bad. And he's making himself look bad by talking that way about a woman, even jokingly. And he got offended. Hmm. And I'm well, I'm sorry. Did Amora get offended? Because isn't it important if Amora even got offended by these? Does Amora statements? even know any of this? Like, how can you be no. offended on on her behalf? I don't understand. No, that. I I don't like to hear any anybody. That's okay. Wait, it's not up to wait, you. Wait, like, if wait, no, like, no, like what you said, is, is, like what I you would, said, dude. It's like what you said. You know what you were doing, Pete. You're trying to be Captain Saberville. Just admit that, and I believe you. I was I was uncomfortable with the way that. I was well, uncomfortable yeah. with the way the conversation was being directed, but it's not, and I didn't want to be part of it. Do you, you see what I mean, Weasley? Not the, you and Telly do this all the time. You he try didn't to, want to be accused of, you know, th- that he was sleeping with I her. Wasn't to, I wasn't accusing him. I wasn't accusing him. I was asking questions, and I was jokingly, jokingly with him because he was being jokingly with me. That's all that happened. But then you, you got uncomfortable I'm, and got and got accusing me of something. And what pissed me off? Let me finish. What pissed me off is about women like my, that. my family and Amora never even was upset. So how could you be upset on Amora's behalf? That's what I don't get. I, I got upset. No, no. Hold on, Weasley. Please let me talk. Because he thought he was, uh, you know, uh, uh, accusing him of sleeping with her. Which I was. Yeah, yes, and then he 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 goes and says, "You said you had a girlfriend, Prince. You said you had a daughter." No, no, I thought the Prince was accusing. Uh, I don't think that Pete. happened. I don't think anybody ever said anything about Pete fucking Imora. I think okay. Pete got upset that Imora was disrespected. Guys, guys, guys. I apologize for the interruption. Kenneth, but I've come on. Kenneth, I've got big Kenneth, news. they're not, I, well, Kenneth, not, Kenneth, they're not talk. hooking up. You can't just it was come just in. No, no, no. Kenneth, please proceed with the joke, breaking Kenneth. news. They are, <sighs> he's going to tell you that Elaine and Andy are hooking up. They're not. It was a joke. Kenneth, don't come in here and completely derail the conversation that we're having. You can't do that. We're having a conversation. You can't just come in here and interrupt everybody. Uh, he's out. He left. I right. mean, come on, dude. That like, was ridiculous. Fuck. But as so, far, as Pete, far as, as, Pete, yeah. you, you can't get mad on Imora's behalf. I wasn't and, if it had, behalf. But that's what it sounds I, I, like. You said, I don't like that don't, she got disrespected. She didn't no, even know like, that she was disrespected. I don't like hearing any man, man, woman, or child disrespected like that. Well, you, you, sir. But it's not you your battle. No, you're not being fully honest. If you're not being fully honest. You picked my family in it, and you said, you said, your own words. Yeah, but, like, Amora might have laughed at that. How are you going to get pissed on her behalf and start this whole war with somebody? You can't do that. I, I mean, I this is what happens it. when you do that. You can't say, hey, bro, I, you can't say that about that girl. He could say whatever well, the fuck he wants about her unless well, she gets well, upset. I think well, he, all, he didn't want to hear it, not that he couldn't it, say it. And I'm exactly. not going to correct anyone, but I, that's the one thing I did hear that he said he didn't want to hear that. And and I can understand that, but again, if you weren't in private messages... Yeah, I guess I don't know what the fuck's happening. It, it, well, I don't... And Prince, as far as, t- as far as Telly, I don't know what's going on with you and him, but I have never, ever, ever to anybody said that you have been anything less than a true friend oh, to Kenneth. Oh, that type of shit, man. You and him always try to always manipulate me and make me feel like shit every time I'm on, with, on there with Kenny. Don't, don't, don't play like you. This is the dude. weirdest beef. I like never predicted this yeah. beef. Okay. No. Okay. How, how do I do Can that? I, how do I do? Shamrock, now, you go. in Telly's defense, although I can't speak for him, I could speak, you know, to his character. Um, he's not a manipulative person, and he's been nothing but nice for Kitty. He doesn't expect anything in return either. I he's know who nice I'm I'm saying he doesn't like me. And and neither Rocky, he, just so you have history on it, Prince had said that he felt Telly was racist towards him. 
And I told him, hey, I can't, you know, (laughs) I'm not black, I'm white. I I have no idea if that's, you know, the vibe you're getting. That's between you and him. But I just wanted you to know that Prince did share that with us. And I just kind of backed off because I would have. Yeah, I'm not black, so I can't have an opinion. Yeah, I I definitely would have stuck up for Telly because I think, I mean, I've gotten along better with him than just. Well, I'm not black either, but we still doesn't mean that we can't say anything. Well, I'm oh, saying no. I don't know how I it feels. I just don't know how it feels oh, oh, okay, to have okay, someone okay. treat me different because of my color. That's what I, I am. Too. A privileged white woman here. I can admit it, and it, it just. I, I wouldn't say I'm privileged, but I am white, and I don't know what it feels like. I can't tell. If, I know that Telly does not seem racist, even a little bit to me. Yeah. But I don't know. I mean, <laughs> the the only thing. Yeah. No way. And I agree with that. You're right, because we're white. I am not sensitive to it. I don't. I don't claim to be. Uh, okay. I, what I did he that. say? That what did he say that you think was racist? Because that's who I grew up with, and I've seen the racism time, towards blacks. The first time, uh, the first I'm time, the I mean, this dude keeps really? staring at me yeah. as if I did something to him. He stares at me, and he is like, he doesn't say, "Hey, Prince." Nonetheless, Kenny introduces me to him. He's like, "Oh, Kelly, this is my buddy, Prince." I'm like, dude, when I pop on there, just say, what's up? Hey, who's this guy? Don't sit there and stare at me for a long time and then say, oh, who's this guy? Who's Max? Who's this guy? No, dude, you literally stared at me for a long ass time. That's racist? Trying to figure out who I am. That's racist. Prince, Prince, in all fairness. Then I literally go backstage. I go backstage and introduce myself to him on the stream yard. And what does he do? He completely ignores me. I sent him a couple messages to this dude, and what does he do? He still please ignore me. So I'm like, okay, maybe he doesn't like my kind. He doesn't like my kind, and I'm okay with that. I'm okay um, with that. I think you're reaching. That w- I don't see the racism in that at all. Prince, in all fairness, the first time, to- uh, the- after the first month or so that I was on tennis panels, he did the same thing with me until he got to know me. He's not what you'd call a warm person, but he's a sincere, respectful person when he gets to know you. Now, that's my impression. Oh, oh my God, Kenneth. Jesus yeah, Christ. Yeah, I know. I'm just so... This is getting crazy. And Kenneth I, is I, killing I, me. Kill. I, 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 oh, Elisa just killed me yesterday when she said that, that she's fine. I'm like, okay, let's I go. I just back <laughs> I the fuck like, up. The I'm not going to have anything to do with it. You call her till your heart's content. And then he tells her to empty her, her voicemail. It's like, oh my god! Did this him I... being all upset about the Elaine oh. thing is what's blowing me away. Yeah, well now he's like, they told me it was a joke. They told me it was a joke. Who he, cares? You know, I know. I'm not angry. Hey, no, I'm I frustrated. With not Colorado. with you guys. With just this no, whole yeah. bullshit going on. I'm over Kenneth. I'm over it. <laughs> yes. Yes. It, it, this whole I server... hope the best for him. Whatever. Yeah. He's a good guy. But I can't anymore. I fucking no, can't. I can't either. <laughs> I love oh, Kenneth. Man. I'm 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 I'm, I'm, I'm working on it, guys. I'm working on it. I'm working on it. I know guys you are. Me. I know you are. See, what was that uh, Howard Stern laugh? What do you mean? You were like, huh, huh, huh. Jay, <laughs> just, that's just actually how I felt. Jay, um, why did you ask thing, Kenneth about slit? Why did you tell Kenneth to slit his throat, Jay, and DM? Jay, what? Do you said that? No, I said that with because I typed fast and then the auto crack came up, whatever. Oh, uh, Jay! Yeah. Don't no, fib. I was in the I was in the voice chat when that happened. Actually, don't fib, Jay. Uh, no, no, because I don't type. I I say what I have to say. I hit the microphone, but it always says something else. What did you mean to say? That I would slit my own throat because of this. What's going on? Oh my god. <laughs> okay, well, the only <laughs> reason I'm mad at Kenneth is because he came in here expecting us all to stop our own conversation yeah. so he could have some breaking news, and I'm over that kind of shit. True, true. Well, was it even important? Yeah, Elaine was kissing Andy Dick. The whole oh, world just no. stopped. Listen, yeah, that's major news. I wanted to hear his announcement. Breaking yeah, news. I want to kiss t Bob. You were the one person out of all of us that wanted to hear it. I'm sorry. Yeah, uh, that would have been great, kind of coming yeah, in. No, you don't get to news. come in and tell ten people to stop talking so that you can get a word. Uh, it was something a out. breaking news alert. Nah, well, we all know that wasn't <laughs> breaking news. We can read. It was a breaking news alert. Sometimes you gotta like get Kenneth down just one little notch so he doesn't go over. How did he get it ahead of you, Geo? You're supposed to be the journalist. I don't think he's a journalist anymore. He's good. He's good. Um, 
Uh, so Prince, are you calm down a little bit or? Yeah, I'm calm, but I'm but I'm, I don't I don't like that. I'm letting you know, Pete. Don't don't Prince, try me Prince, like that. Don't ever try me Prince, like that, dude. Prince, just make up, no guys. One. Just make up. I promise not to and, be and too easily, anymore. Hold on, too easily. That that was I got to say that was for you, man. The whole Lisa Joe Cannon's gonna witness murder. I I threw that in there for you. Well, don't do that. I, I, I had I had to throw that in. There. I don't know why I threw it in there, but I had to throw it in there. Yeah, no more Prince, of that. I got, no, I got nothing from love for you, but I got. Uh, I'm wired strange th that there's certain thing, things I just don't want to talk about, and it has nothing to do with anything else other than the fact that that's just me. That's not against you because I think you know damn well. I've taken your calls. I've taken your. I've taken your DMs. We've talked about everything what, you've wanted to talk. The thing is, bro. The thing is, bro. What made you uncomfortable? Because I really didn't say anything disrespectful. We were just joking around. You didn't even said it. We were joking her. around. Oh my god. Oh, he's because, calling her. <laughs> yeah, that's how he. Yeah, he was calling. Yeah, because she, he's gonna if, blow if, her phone up. I guarantee. Truthfully, you. if someone, uh, I think of my own kid, and if someone said that about her, I'd be in jail. I Don't understand that, dude. But I didn't, but I didn't say that to her. That's the thing. I said it to you. I said it to you. To I you. Understand understand that but you and i have something in common okay we we both have we both have daughters and i wouldn't if if someone did that to your daughter and we were lived in close proximity i'd be up as a, i'd say what's going on you know i try to give people the same degree of respect that i want and there's there's certain things Excuse me, guys, breaking, breaking, news, news. breaking news just kidding sorry there's certain, <laughs> things, I, there's certain things i just don't joke about prince and that's one of them now, if you took that the wrong way, if you felt disrespected, I'm sorry, but there's certain things I just don't joke about, and that's one of them. What I took the wrong way is when you said that I that I I'm cute I'm, I'm that I was disrespecting her, and then you turned around there. I said I said you were I said you were speaking disrespectfully. Me, okay. Let me tell you what 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 pissed me off and what I felt was disrespectful to me. The fact that you mentioned my daughter. I felt like you were attacking me that you no, mentioned my daughter. No, 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 not, not at all. No, 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 let me finish. Okay, you said ahead. a fiery man would not talk about that to another female. And then you mentioned my girlfriend, you mentioned my daughter, and I literally responded, hey, man, leave my family out of this. I, and you kept on saying, you, know you kept on saying, if you're a family I'm, man like you say you are, and if you're a kind man like you say you are, you wouldn't even think about saying something like that. So basically, we, you, we, you, you know kind of attacked me, bro. You kind of right, attacked me. Well, you know what? You know what? If, you took, if you took that the wrong way, I apologize, but I would hope you wouldn't want anyone to speak to, to about your girlfriend that way, even in jest. And certainly when your daughter comes of age, I would hope you would not want someone to speak of her that way. That's and, what I'm saying. I, why are you putting that in this conversation? That's the because, question I'm asking you. Why would you even throw that in the conversation? What is my, someone, my, 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 my daughter? Because, I have because, to do it. Some, because somebody did that to me once uh, as far as the way I joked around, and it made me look at things a little differently. That's all. That's uh, and and they were absolutely right. If it's something all. strange happening in your hood, who are you gonna Curve call? Busters. Not Elisa. Call she Elisa. Me? Prince, you took oh, it the wrong way. Lord. If you took if if you felt disrespected, I'm sorry. But there's there's certain there's certain paths I just don't go down. That's one of them. I understand yeah. that, dude. I understand and if, that. If, if, hear me out. If, if, if Amora even uh, care, like, do, 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 if Amora doesn't care, why would you guys care? Amora's in uh, here, by the way. Yeah, but Amora, did you I, care about any of this? She doesn't like, know I mean, about any of it. She does, Amora doesn't even know about it. You guys have a knockout, dragout fight over a comment that was said about a girl that doesn't even know the comment was said. We said what it was. You literally said what it was. You know what he was doing. Weird. I'm, all I'm gonna say to you, Pete, is no disrespect. You can be a Catholic shaving hole, but just don't do it. Don't do it. <laughs> it's got nothing to do with that. Okay, it's got you nothing don't do to do with me. That. Don't I just do didn't want. I, there's certain roads I don't want to go down. That's one of them. That's it understandable. Can man, it can be man, don't woman, child. Don't ever try to in the near future. Don't ever try to be man, now. Woman, what if Emora would have laughed? Plant. What if Emora liked the joke and she laughed at it? Then what? Then, Are you then, still allowed to be offended on her behalf? No, then I'm offended. I, I was only offended, offended on my on behalf. behalf. That's what no, I think. I was, how are I was you offended, offended on my behalf? Something, but how? He said something about her. How are you offended about that? That's what I don't get. I, I, because I, do, I try not to, sp to joke that way about people. Yeah, but it wasn't a joke about you. How could you be and, so upset about a joke about a girl that you barely know? I was I wasn't upset about it. It's just that that's just a road I don't go down. 
Right, but who are you to tell him not to make a joke about a girl? I didn't tell him guys- not to. I just said I wanted no part of it. And I, w- I was hoping, I was hoping if, if he understood that, you know what, you, you don't want that someone like joking about, you know, people close to you. And, and it, it was a bad I example. Don't, I don't get it, it was I a don't. bad example, and I'm sorry about it. But that's just how I'm wired. I don't. Right, there's certain ropes that's I like, will not it's go like down. Trying to teach him a lesson about something, and it's really not no, your no, spot. I was try- no, I was trying to make him understand why it made me uncomfortable. And the one thing that ev- just about everybody can whoa, understand. Whoa, 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 Back it up, back it up, back it up, back it up. Motherfucker, who are you going to teach me something? I'm 26 okay, years old. I can say, who, I can say whatever the fuck I want. I'm okay, a grown ass man. Prince I'm a grown ass man. I can say whatever I want. What I want. I'm a grown ass man. I'm 26 years old. You don't need to teach me nothing, okay? You're not even Prince, a father for you to me. You need Prince, to chill with that. Number one. Prince, it was a poor right. choice of words. Are, you know what? We can agree to disagree. Can you guys you say the it? joke in front of Imora so that we can find out if she's uh, upset by it? And then if she's upset by it, then Pete, I guess you did a good job. But if she's not upset by it, I still don't understand how you would fight this fight on her behalf. I wasn't fighting on anyone's behalf. I just said I didn't want to talk about it. I didn't want to talk about it, that's all. All right. All right, man. All right. I'm over this now. If you want to be okay, her lawyer, be, be her attorney, no. be her public defender. I'm doing it. No. Do it. No. Prince, I'm done with it, and like I said, as far as the thing with Telly, I have never, ever said anything but res- but imp- how impressive you are, the way you look out for Kenneth, the way you clearly have a burden for him. Your problem with Telly, uh, I don't know what you think's going on there, but I'll tell you one thing I do know about him, and I think Shamrock will back me up. If you got a problem with him, he's pretty damn approachable. Yeah, Tilly is like, as far as I know, he's very straight up. He really does just want to help Kenneth. That's what I think. Oh, yeah. I, I definitely think that, but I understand where you're being protective of Kenneth. I do understand that. Um, but I think, I, I truly believe in my heart that Telly, I mean, I've seen his home, and I can tell you that he is very he don't well need anybody's. He don't need anybody's money. I know him yeah. and his wife, yeah. And I'm well, not, not saying... Only, yeah, I mean, the money thing is weird because it, if you think about it, Kenneth could just press add cash on his cash app and it would come out of Telly's bank account. So if there's anything weird about that, it should be Telly worried about Kenneth because it's not even Kenneth's bank account. It's his cash app. Yeah. So it's, it, he can't... Like, you Telly, see, would, uh, Telly uh, couldn't even take that money. See, it would be, it. It'd be the other see. way around. Yeah. There's nothing weird now about Kelly and Kenneth. Now you're starting to see. See what? Yeah, what? What's he starting to see? Kenneth, have, I, Kenneth doesn't. First of all, Kenneth doesn't need, doesn't need the money. He doesn't really need the money. Rather, it's in whoever's account. He don't need the money. And I told him that time and time again. His own stepmother told him that, but he they, they don't want to listen. They never listen to me. But yet, but yet, like I said. I'm always the bad guy. Oh, Prince doesn't know what he's talking about, but yet I, I met this guy. But everybody wants to turn a blind it, eye on what I'm saying. And that's okay, why he's doing minute. what he's doing. And that's okay, why wait. he's doing what he's doing. I'm sitting there trying to put a stop to it, but no one wants to listen to me. So if he wants Prince? to call Delisa all day long, let him. Let him. Because as Prince? of right now, I can't control him right now. No matter Prince, how hard I try, I can't control Prince. him right now. Prince, you have about six or seven people here that are listening to you. What are people not seeing regarding his cash app? It doesn't need the money. His own stepmother said that. He doesn't need the money. The whole donation thing doesn't make any sense. He can do the channel without the donations. Many people have done it before. He doesn't need it. Well, and, and he's not, he's not, what I'm trying to say is, he's just like me. He's not in a capable mindset to even handle the money. Why did he feel he needed the cash app? That would be the next question. I don't know. That one's for Telly. I don't know why Telly wanted to make up a cash app. And it's uh, the boy right. does not Yeah, Kenneth can tell you that he actually wanted the cash app. K- Kenneth is the one that approached Telly with it the first time. And Telly did ask him, you've cleared this with your stepmom and yada, yada, He did it. We did not. Well, I know, but, but, but and he's you gone. have to understand because uh, he knows that this was a fib and I shouldn't have said anything. No. But he he did say that he told Telly that he did clear it with his stepmom. We all know now that he didn't, but he 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 did tell Telly that, just in fairness for Telly, because I actually heard it. Um, and it was on a live stream 
when they were. Does his stepmother that. want him my, to get rid my, of it? My Prince? sense is what I told him, dude. Dude, you already have money. Me and you both, and Max Lee. The, we we already do something called a check. We get a check at the end of the month from the government for our special needs. You already have money. Why do you need to set up a cash app? That's owned by somebody else. Well, not, not even not even owned, monitored by someone else, just so you can get money. That don't make no sense to me. As a dude, you already have money coming in. You already have money, and that's what his stepmom tried to explain to him. But for some reason, he thinks he needs a cash app monitored oh. by by Telly. Okay, well, you told him that. What was his answer? Well, it's for the channel. It's for the channel. It's donations. Blah, blah, blah. I'm like, but but the money when you when they donate. The question I have for him, where's the money going, Kenny? Like, what, what do you spend the money on for? What do you spend the money for? And at first, I thought he was spending money on getting presents for Elisa. I literally thought that, too. I think we all thought that. And that was, you know, again, I can speak for me. And I know there were a couple of other people that have come to me since then and, and agreed that we thought we were in the hundreds of dollars range when Kenneth was talking. Oh, when about he mentioned that 550? Absolutely. Yeah. Yeah, and I told him the I knew I right away it was five and fifty cents. That kid, really? I should have, you know what? And I almost messaged you just out of sheer concern. <laughs> yeah, I knew it was five dollars and fifty cents, cents, which is like the best kind of present. Like, I, it's much, much better for at five dollars and fifty cents than five hundred and fifty dollars. Oh, I mean, oh, yeah, that makes completely sense. better. I mean, oh. like, fuck, I would if somebody did that for me, I would think that is just a lot more thoughtful. Oh, a hundred percent. Like, I'd be so pissed if, yeah, if Tina spent 550 bucks, oof. So I knew. But hey, listen, when it comes to the cash app, Kenneth should have a cash app if he wants one. If he wants one, good, have one. Get all the money you want. I don't give two fucks about that. And now there was the the one thing Prince is going to tell you that since he gets SSI or something. Yeah, that he shouldn't be doing that, yeah. Right. But, but... Telly is 100% right. I know for a fact you can get up to, I didn't know the exact amount. but I think it's 600 13, bucks. 1300 is what Telly ah. said. So well, not only that, Telly would be. 600, he's only at 30 bucks. Well, not only that, it, if it's in Telly's bank account, he's the one exactly. paying taxes on it. Yes. And so it's a Telly gift. Said. It's a yes. gift to uh, Kenneth yes. at that point. Something so, he okay. said he would happily do if it got to a point that taxes became applicable. Right. And, and right now, under the new laws, anything up to $600 is not taxed, but after $600, it is taxed. But you can gift somebody thirteen grand or 1300 So, I mean, we shouldn't be talking about Kenneth's finances. I think that's one of his rules. Oh. I, I, well, I think that should be anyway. <laughs> it's none of our where, I'm, where I'm coming from. I agree. And I told us, and I told us this, guys, I told them time and time again, what you really should do with the money, you should, like, go to an online website and pay, and pay yeah, people, whatever pay people wants. to have merchandise. I told them, you can pay people to make your merchandise, make kind of t-shirts, wristbands, hoodies. You should give back to the people that are watching you. That's what most YouTube content creators do. They save their money up, and they make t-shirts, and then they make, that's how they make their income, but he doesn't want to listen to me that. Well, doesn't he doesn't have to do. listen to any of us. He gets to spend that money on whatever he wants. If he wants to buy ice cream with it, good, good on you, Kenneth. Like Plus, anything uh, he wants. With his SSI, does he help out his uh, stepmom at home, or is it all? Does it all go to him? He gives him an allowance. Okay. Yeah. And she's yeah. the guardian, so she probably, you know, gives him here is X amount of dollars if you need more, you know, kind of thing. But let's face it, what is it he needs? She buys the food. I'm sure she buys the toiletries. And well, and the, you know, again, it's, like none of, it's none of and our And it's business. really none of our, you're right. It's creepy talking about yeah, that. Yeah, yeah, it is. Tell us the breaking news now, Kenneth. No, ha- Prince, you. You, caught me, you caught me at a bad time. I was uncomfortable. If you needed to hear why, I apologize. I didn't give you the time you needed. I apologize. Hey. What's up, breaking news? Come on, Kenneth. Hurry. Right here, so what Kenneth. I have been told, Elaine and Andy are hooking up. Do you think they're you having might, sex? You might need to go live for this. Kenneth, oh, are they having oh, sex? Or they just did? <laughs> Can you confirm if tongue oh. was used? Oh, jeez. I, I think from the video, in the video. That, are they 16? The video have, that or... I saw, from the video that I, I saw, tongue was indeed used. Okay, oh my God. God. was used. Wow. wow. Have y'all seen the video? Years? Have y'all seen the video? Yes, I have. Okay, all right, just making sure. Now, just Andy. to remind you guys, Elisa's never kissed Andy Dick, and that's her fiance. And so now her friend is French kissing him. Imagine. Wow. 
Are they exchanging food in there? I couldn't tell. It looked like, yes. It looked it like did. he was trying to give her something to eat, or he is literally well, the worst And Elaine's 67, ever. 66 years old, something like that. So go Elaine is what, what? I have to say. Oh, yeah. She for looks sure. amazing. Um, yes, she does. And when, wow. she, she does. And, when, um, and when Elisa told me this, he said, make sure that I told, that I tell everyone. Oh no! That's why I'm saying yeah. you might need to go you know. live. Tell her, tell her we're shocked. We're just, we're just. And then I told you we're this. Uh, That's hilarious. Yeah, I'm sorry um, that I um, that I jumped when you said it. I just wanted to let them. They were so. Close well, yeah, it was an intricate it moment. Oh, it was an important moment, that's Kenneth. Why, and... That's why I. Uh, that's why I exited. Okay, well, I thought finish. you were upset. I thought you were mad at me because no, you no, no, so no, 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 no. I wasn't mad. Okay, I good. I wasn't Kenneth. mad. I was. I just stepped out. Thank you, Kenneth. Up. Thank you for the update. I have you mad at me? I'd be very upset if you were mad at me. No, no, yes. no. I'm not mad. Oh, I couldn't. I'm, yeah, don't I'm ever good. get mad at me, please. I love you to pieces. I'm good. Yeah. I'm good. I'm a girl, so I... <laughs> I'm, I'm good. Trust me. I'm not, I'm not mad. Can you believe that, though? Oh, my gosh. I wonder if paparazzi will find out. And, I wonder if they're 69ing. You're so bad. You're so bad. Weezy, you're killing me. And you're so bad. I even and I even asked Elisa this. Oh, well, I was like, Kenneth, let's, get, let's get the ball rolling. Go ahead and go live. Get the ball rolling, man. What did you ask Elisa? What did you ask Elisa, Ken? I asked her when she told me this. I was like, "Is there any truth to this?" She said, "Yes." Oh. So she was, told you. <laughs> <laughs> so she told you that they're hooking up. That was her. Yep. Oh, so her words, not mine. And she's okay she with us telling everyone, right? That's what she told me. She Have said protection. to make sure that I tell everyone. I love it. I love and I'm like, it. okay. Well, thank you thank for telling you. us. I'm sorry that it was prolonged on my behalf. But it's much tell, better now because tell her the happy. community is shocked. Yes. You don't call, call her and tell her that, though, unless I'm not, you want. Yeah. Wait till you, you can ready to you go can, to bed uh, before you call, well, her. call her. You can call her call late her. tonight because it's Saturday night. He's going to call her I'm late. not going to be up too much longer. Well, call I'll, her before you go to bed. I'll... Let her know that you're thinking about her. Yeah. And let her know that you told all of us and we all just have our jaws dropped. Call her this and we, we want to hear details Let's... tomorrow on the show. I will, I will make sure of it. Give me just okay. a moment. I'll, okay. I'll... Oh, he's going to take care of it right frickin' now. Oh, no. Oh. What have we started? Pretty what funny. is he doing? He's so happy, though. He's calling her now. 